Hello, I'm Lee from Data Harvest. In this video today, we're going to show you how the wireless light gates can be used for Newton's second law. So we've got two light gates here with our dynamic system. We've got a cart with an interrupt card, so you can have a double interrupt or a single interrupt here. And we're going to use a single interrupt because we're using two light gates. So these fit really easily straight onto the cart. So we can pop that onto there. So we can do the first read and let the cart go without any extra masses inside. It will go through A to collect velocity at A. Then it'll collect velocity at B. Go to the end. Hopefully you can see the pulley and the mass on the end there. We then have two extra masses. So we're going to do the reading three times, one without a mass, one with one mass. And then the last reading will, will be with two masses. So we start by turning the light gate on. Now, because we've got two light gates, uh, to make them uh, sync up and work superbly, you have a connection lead. Well, you have to use a lead due to the limitations of Bluetooth, not our equipment. Bluetooth will not work quick enough on really fast time and experiments. So the lead just makes sure everything syncs up superbly. So I'm now going to go to the EasySense 2 software and click on connect. So we've got number 146. So they've all got their own unique number on the light gate. So when you have multiples of these within the classroom, they'll all say light gate, but then they all have their own six digit number afterwards. So each student will know which one they are using. So make sure you've got two light gates collected, uh, selected on here. I'm now going to go to timing. Now for Newton's second law, we simply click on the setup down the bottom. We want to have velocity. So it's A then B, not A or B or A to B, it's at A then B, so make sure you click the right one. Now there are all worksheets on our website which guide you through this, so please go to the product page for the wireless light gates, which is product number 1200, and then have lots of worksheets there for you to download free of charge. Okay. So we've got the length of the card, which is the length of this. That's 120 milli uh, millimeters, so that's superb. So pop that on there. But I do also need to have the time. If I'm not showing the time, then obviously the students can't work out the acceleration for themselves. So I've got that selected on there as well. So now before I start logging, I am just going to bring this up, start at the same place each time. So I'm going to start it on the tape measure there, which says 35. So I'm now going to click the start button. We're all logging. Here we go. So we're ready on 35. Let that pass through the two light gates. There you go. So we're now taking that reading superbly. Take it round. Now, the reason I'm taking it round is this light gate is live now. If I push it back up the track, it will trigger it. OK, so you just need to make sure you uh, take it round or you can just stop and start. It's up to you. But we're on 35 here. So we'll now do the next one and we're now going to add a mass. And we're now ready on there and we let that go. Now taking the second one. Take that round again. And the last reading is going to be with the third one in here. And we're now through accordingly. So you now have your velocity at A, then B, time in between. For those three readings with the different masses, the students can then work out the acceleration themselves. There are lots more videos on all of the product pages for our wireless sensors, as well as on our secondary academy. So please go to the drop down menu teaching on data-harvest.co.uk click on the secondary academy and then there's three sections for the videos. The first section is how the Bluetooth sensors work. The second section is how you use them in the experiments. And the third section is how the EasySense 2 software works. If you have any questions or need any support, please contact us. Just drop us an email on sales at data-harvest.co.uk. Thank you.